Carissa in the build and how's everybody doing today I'm on here to share some of my secrets as a mom on how to grow your kids hair build a cradle cap and all I just wanted to come on here and share for new moms or moms that have kids already how to grow your kids hair and how to stay away from cradle cap if you run into it because like I did I ran into it with my daughter and I ran into with my baby son my my recent baby I just had which he is nine months already he's such a big boy now he knows how to scoot crawl and he sits on his own and he stands of course so let's get into it guys how to grow your kids hair and do a cradle cap here's a few of my secrets tips and tricks on how to grow your kids hair Okay, let me set you down right here because I do got to stand. Sorry for my hair. It's wet. I just got fresh out of the shower, guys. So let's get into the video. Yay. So here are some products that I recommend, okay? Which for cradle cap, we get the organic um, coconut oil, which help my kids excuse my nail. I'm taking off my nails for my birthday nails, but... So I'm about to go get them done this weekend. But this is Cradle Cap. Let me do the camera a little bit higher. So this is what I use for Cradle Cap. I'm also going to put pictures on the left side to show you my daughter went bald. And I'm going to put uh, on the right side of the camera, I'm going to put the pictures that her hair grew back. Um, my daughter is currently two going on three this year so I'm gonna put her baby pictures in to show you guys how to grow your kids hair back and how to get rid of cradle cap but yes when I ran into cradle cap with my daughter and hair loss because they do get hair loss um coming up when they're like three to six months they start losing their hair so this is what I use on my daughter's hair what I did was I put this on after i did the shampoo i will put this in the hair i believe this in for like two to three minutes max five minutes in their hair while i bathe them first i'll wash the hair then add this in there let it sit for three to five minutes max and while i'm letting this sit in the hair guys this organic you can get this in any local grocery store anywhere amazon anywhere it's not a sponsorship this is just the tips and secrets i use for my kids hair for cradle cap and to grow your kids hair okay because i'm a mom of four and i'm very uh, i have experience at growing hair so yes my daughter had cradle cap and hair loss i use this in her hair like i said i did this um shampoo first make sure you shampoo and massage the hair the scalp and everything for like at least a minute and then after you did do that and you rinse the hair off don't bathe the baby yet because you're going to want this to sit in there for two to five minutes okay after I did the hair wash, I would add this, let it sit, bathe the baby or my daughter, just bathe, added a coconut oil because you 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 can leave this in, but I prefer to rinse it out because it'll be like very greasy and moisturized. It'll moisturize the hair overnight if you want to put like um um bonnet on, whatever the case might be, whatever whatever you prefer. This is what I did, okay. After that, I would use like a basic uh, um, Jamaican castor oil. You can use the coconut one, the coconut oil, or you can use the mango flavor or the original flavor. You can use this flavor. It doesn't matter as long as it's Jamaican castor oil in general, period. You're going to want to use this in your kid's hair, baby hair, okay? Cause it's not strong at all i use it in my um nine month baby's hair every time he takes a bath this is what i use in his hair it stopped cradle cap it stopped everything and i also use this as well for his hair and it, it grew because he was starting to shed a little bit so i used this one then i started to switch out and just use just this one because 
This one's got coconut oil as well in it, so you're not gonna need this one. But if you do have cradle cap, I prefer you to use this one. This one's gonna be dry based on the baby's hair when the baby's fresh out the tub and you wanna have coconut oil in the baby's hair through the whole day or the whole night, okay? Here's some other products that I like to use personally on my kids' hair, personally. We're gonna get Second, you guys can see my, my whole face, okay? Because your girl's standing up, sitting down. Uh, I like Blue Magic products. These are the number one hair growth products out here, guys. You want your hair to be nice and scalp. This one is the hair and scalp conditioner. One, I just bought this one, it's brand new. This is what I use in my daughter's hair now. And what I use as well for the Super super Sure Bro by Blue Magic Originals. It's got um, shea butter, Japanese green tea leaves, and it's got all other types of oils in it as well. So this is what I use every day. You can guys kind of kind of tell it's been used. I use it every day on my kids' hair, okay? That's what you're gonna want. And it also got a good, 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 good smell. Okay? So go ahead, order your Blue Magic products. I order from the Walmart website. You can also go in store, but when I'm on the go or I need something, or I just don't feel like going to the grocery store, like right then and there to get it, I order my products online and they deliver it right to your door. So yes, get Blue Magic products. They are magic and they do grow your hair. Also, shea, more, uh, shea moisture products grow your hair as well. I use shea moisture and so does my kids and it also got shea moisturizer and they got a bunch of stuff by shea moisture, okay? I love their products. They don't dry your hair out. They keep your hair moisturized. They keep your hair feeling good and everything, okay? I want to do the tip for the parents as well for babies, okay? This is a Blue Magic product and also it's coconut oil. If you want a dry product as well as the, as the Jamaican castor oil products as well, and you want to have something besides the Jamaican castor oil, get the coconut oil. It works really, 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 really good. As you guys can see, let me show you guys how much I use, okay? Yeah, that's how much I use my products, okay? Got some products in it because it's mixed up in other products. Those are the products I like to use in my kids' hair. All I do is shampoo, um, comb, and just style away. You can either put a bonnet on, or like I said, like the baby freestyle. My baby's nine months, so all I do is add just this in his hair and um, the other one in his hair. I use these two products. If I don't have this and I run out of this, I'm going to my cabinet to grab this for his hair. I use nothing but coconut in his hair, okay? Nothing but coconut. Not these other um, products, Blue Magic, the Sure, the Super Sure Growth. I don't use this in his hair yet because his hair is kind of, he's kind of still fresh out the womb. So you want to use something that's going to not only damage, not damage your hair per se, but something that's not too strong on the baby's hair. Because you got to understand babies are very sensitive. So you're going to want to use products that are more mild to a baby's head. Like you want like a baby's butt, baby's fresh. You don't want to use nothing on the baby's skin or anything. Like I said, I'm a mom of four. These are the products I like to use on hair to grow my baby's hair back. Like I said, on the left side, you're going to see pictures of my daughter's hair when she was a baby, when she was bald on the back. And you're going to see on the right side where her hair grew back to where it's got hair around her head and her hair grew back and now she's going on three she has hair and it's gorgeous okay so like i said any new moms out there or you thinking about getting pregnant and you thinking about what you use on your baby's hair like i said grab products that are going to be very sensitive for baby's hair like you want something that's mild you want something that doesn't break off you want something that's not too strong but like i said baby's fresh out of a womb and you don't want to do a cradle cap this is to go to this organic version coconut oil organic version version coconut oil that's what you want to get from your local grocery store and yes you can use this on other products you can use this on skin you can use it to cook with you can use this on your lips you can use this with your toothbrushes this coconut oil is magic it works wonders with every single thing that you own in your house even down to you okay coconut oil is the best best um thing for babies especially with cradle cap 
okay so i want you guys to be aware about these products certain products you can't use in baby's hair some parts you can use in baby's hair but from based on from experience from me this is what i use for cradle cap okay like i said give a baby hair wash wash the baby's hair real good tie not to use okay okay i'm gonna give you something a tip because my baby had cradle cap and i didn't use my hands to scrub the head i used um you know when you have a baby and you go to the hospital, they give you a bowl of um, things from the hospital. Like the bowl comes with one of those things to suck the nose. They give you a brush. Save that brush and that bowl you get from the hospital. Take it with you home because they let you take it home. They let you take everything from the hospital home. And sorry, you hear my kids in the background, but I'm about to go. But save it and do um for your baby's hair when you wash your baby's hair from a cradle cap okay guys because you're going to want to use that brush you're going to want to take care of the baby's head you the baby's head is very sensitive so do not scrub with your hands please use that brush okay because that brush really comes in handy all you got to do is um put the um coconut oil and just brush it and then put some on the skin and it's going to clear the skin up and it's going to clear the um cradle cap up but guys like i said subscribe to my youtube channel subscribe subscribe share turn on your post notifications every time i drop a um, video you guys will be notified please comment down in the description below all my social media platforms are going to be in the description below as well i'm on tiktok facebook instagram all the links are going to be in the description below 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 tell a friend 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 tell, a friend. tell everybody to subscribe to my youtube channel and i'm out peace out guys i love you don't forget to be you do you love you and always put yourself first Love you so yeah. others can love you back. If you're not taking care of yourself, nobody's going to take care of you. So, guys, stay tuned for the next video. And we out of here. See you later. Remember to subscribe, 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 and turn on the post notifications. And we out of here. Peace.